For Creamer Media, I'm Lum Gilengkompe. Joining me is Talbot CEO Carl Haycock, here to discuss the state of the country's water sector ahead of National Water Week. Can you highlight the significance of this year's Water Week under the theme Water for All, and what sort of impact do you think this will have? So I think it's a it's a very apt um, theme for for this year's uh, for this year's Water Week, probably for any year's Water Week, um, and especially I suppose in the light of the recent, certainly in South Africa, the recent outbreaks of disease associated with with water um, in the northern parts of the country. Um, you know, water is on the forefront of everyone's minds at the moment, um, and I think as you know. Um, water is recognised in terms of shrine in terms of the South African Constitution as a right that everyone has. Um, we're one of 52 countries in the world, as far as I'm aware, um, that has you know the right to water enshrined within their constitution. Um, you know, and in fact, that was you know that was enshrined in our constitution early in the early 90s. Um, whereas the United Nations only really adopted it as a you know as a as a human right in 2010. Um, it's also one of the objectives of uh, the Sustainable Development Goals uh, number six, so obviously water and sanitation. So I think from a South African point of view, in terms of the current state of water infrastructure and the fact that you know we are battling with water in the country, I think it is a it's an absolutely appropriate theme for for the Water Week. How will this affect ordinary citizens in future? if the country's water issues are not properly addressed? Water is in absolutely everything. Every single product that we deal with on a day-to-day basis, every single you know, item of food that we eat, every piece of clothing has had water in it in one form or another. Okay, so if we don't deal with the water crisis, a few things are going to happen. One, we're going to see more, you know, more and more disruption associated with water supply. Okay, that's going to have a knock-on effect on on production and industry. Um, you know, let alone not having water, um, you know, at home. If you you know if you're fortunate enough to have water on tap in your house, you know your taps will be dry from time to time. And I think we're already seeing that in parts of the country due to failing water infrastructure. That was Talbot CEO Carl Haycock discussing the state of the country's water sector.